Hello everybody and welcome back to the Dragon Quest X Let's Play. I'm your host, Saigon. This is episode whatever. I don't know anymore. I've been playing Halo for like the last three weeks. Um, I think we're doing the Green Shrine. Uh, so yeah, I've been playing the crap out of Halo. And I know everyone's like, Sai, Sai, do more Dragon Quest X videos, please. We can get all the Halo we want. No problem at all. But nobody does Dragon Quest X videos. And, well, yeah, you're completely right. But you can't stop me from doing Halo videos. I actually just I had a really strong urge to do some more Dragon Quest X. I do love this game. And hopefully I'll get back to doing more online soon as well. Do I? You know what? I actually I set out of town without even checking my inventory. Do I really have nothing in my inventory? Nothing at all? Uh, I guess that's fine. But what we do have is... Was that green? Gray. Did we already do the green shrine? Or do we need to do the gray shrine? I can't remember. Which one did we do last time? We did the one that was over this way. You know what? We can see it from this hilltop over here. Let's go check. No, I still cannot quite get the colors right on this screen. Hold on just a moment. I'm going to see if I can mess with this at all. There we go. I think that looks better. You tell me. <laughs> I cannot tell. These are not the best cables. They're only like $30. I am looking at getting a better option uh, to record in HD. I'm sure everyone will enjoy that. Okay, so that is green. We need the gray shrine. Let's go find the gray shrine. Or did we do the gray shrine last time and we needed the green shrine? I totally cannot remember what we did. I'll know as soon as we set foot inside. I'll be like, yes, we have done this. Or no, no, we have not. So how's everyone doing? Doing well, I hope. Been jonesing for some sweet Dragon Quest X videos. Okay, yeah, I've already been in here. Otherwise, it would have asked me if I wanted to use the key. I really should just, like, research my previous videos before jumping into them. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I am correct. Get out of here. Go back to exploring. I think the Gray Shrine might just be this one right nearby. Right down that way. Like, straight as the bird flies. As the crow flies, as they say. Crow, right? As the crow flies? As the raven flies? I'm not sure. I get my sayings mixed up sometimes. Oh, is this magic water? Just lying on the beach? Sweet. God, I love Slime Knights, and for that, he must die.
Oh, <laughs> I don't know why I moved out of the way. I really should be trying to protect the casters, huh? No. <laughs> I'm like, oh, oh, you want to hit my caster? Yeah, sure, I'll move out of the way for you. <laughs> That's what first-person shooters do to you. <laughs> they remove your sense of compassion. Like, oh, it's okay. You can go ahead and beat, our, beat her up. <laughs> I don't mind. <laughs> Just so long as it's not me. That is the gold shrine. This is not where we're supposed to be. Load faster. I also got a new import game, and I'm definitely going to uh, show it off later. I'll do a collection update video, and uh, I, I think people will be excited to see a Let's Play on it, because it's another Dragon Quest game that didn't come out here in the U.S., Uh, there is no translation of it, either, so there's going to be a lot more bumbling around, trying to figure out what to do. But hey, that's fun. And, um, Dragon Quest Seven for the 3DS. That is the Red Shrine. I'm excited. I did an announcement video. Everyone actually seemed very keen on the announcement video. Um, if you guys would like me to also bring to you screenshots and further news on the announcement of more Dragon Quest games, you know what? Go ahead. Leave me a comment. Let me know. Uh, I will continue being a source of news to you. Uh, just as the Dragon's Den tends to be a source of news to me. I don't know why I decided to attack these trees. I know they're... kind of tough. Uh, I'm doing reasonable enough damage to him. He's not one-shotting my poor thief. just kind of time-consuming, it feels like. Like, he's just strong enough that you shouldn't be bothering fighting him. It's alright, I'll go around. Uh. It's nice having an empty inventory, I don't feel opposed to picking up stuff. Usually I'm rock walking around with three quarters of my bag filled up with just, like, inane things that I have no idea what they are. Because I haven't been paying attention to translating them. Alright, so there's... I'm just going to call him Atlas. I haven't tried fighting him yet. I'm going to wait until later to do so. He seems like the type who would just, you know... Oh, I don't know, mash my face in with that tree that he's using for a club. I don't like that idea. And neither should you. What is this sign? Oh, it's just directions. Stuff that way. Sounds good. Hooray! Yippee! Woohoo! Oh, and um, King Zenith, if you're watching this, I have not forgotten about pulling the enemy data for you. Uh, I will be doing that again soon. I just decided to wait until I was done with the offline game before I finished pulling all the enemy data. And I feel like I'm starting to close in on the offline game. It's definitely feeling more like kind of a uh, attachment side quest to the online story. I don't see it really lasting beyond these shrines. Um, I could be totally, 
totally and completely wrong, and this could just be the beginning of the offline game. We'll see. I think the um, the numbers for the first like month or so of this have come out of Japan. They sold. Uh, I'm just estimating this number based on the numbers that I already saw. So, you know, take this information at face value. I think it was like 700,000 copies. Which is small for a Dragon Quest game, but huge for a Japanese MMO. That is seven times what Final Fantasy XI did. Which was considered to be a successful MMO in Japan. Not so much by American standards. You know, we've got WoW over here. And, like, you know, the Old Republic with, you know, ten times that many players. But, uh, those are really, really solid numbers. And I think they had upwards of 400,000 subscribers. So that's over half of the people who purchased the game continued playing fast past that uh, initial 20-day grace period. That is really, really good. They had more subscribers paying for the game in their first month than they had purchasers of Final Fantasy XI. That's successful. I'm happy to hear that. Uh, it leads me to believe that we'll probably get the game here. Which, yeah, okay, let, let me cover that again, because I get this question all the time. Is this game out yet? Well, in Japan, yes it is. What system is this game for? Well, it's for the Wii. There's a Japanese version that is going into beta for the Wii U starting early 2013. I think it was February. When is this game's U.S. release date? Nobody knows. It hasn't had an actual announcement of getting a U.S. release. That doesn't mean that we will not be getting it. That just means we haven't heard anything yet. It could mean that we are not getting it. I think that'd be really silly. We've gotten every single um, main series Dragon Quest release since 7. Oh, let's see. What other questions do I keep getting that I've already answered? Um, ba -ba 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 that th Those are really the main ones. It's on the Wii. It's on the Wii U. Oh, hey, another boss. This guy looks cool. Was this kind of monster in other Dragon Quest games? I don't... He doesn't look familiar to me. I only played, like, the first 20, 30 hours of DQ7. I've played most of 5, and I haven't touched 6 at all. But, uh, aside from those, I've played a fair bit of Dragon Quest, and this guy doesn't look familiar to me. I'm not even going to try to translate his name. It's been too long since I've actually looked at reading any Japanese. It's gone. It's totally gone. If you don't use it, you lose it. Alright, let's rock and roll. Oh, what are you casting? Yow! Okay, guys, you really want to be backing up. <laughs> My god, that hurt. Alright, that's not bad. I wonder if I can... Was that oomph? That was oomph. Okay. He hits like a freaking truck. Let's finish him off quick. I think I should get some oomph onto the thief. Yeah, I'm thinking that'd be wise. <laughs> oh. 
get another one on him. No, not my healers! Shoot, I already told him to cast a spell. Oi! Okay, that's got him doing significantly more damage than he was before. I mean, he's only hitting for 10, but, you know, that's five times more than two. We got this. He's already yellow. He just hits really hard. <gasps> oh my god. No, you don't. Don't hit her. Leave her alone. Run, Pinky! I don't know her name. Mimina? Yeah, run, Mimina. Oh, I wish I knew, like, Double Slash or something. Run, Pinky! Get out of here! Toss me a heal, for Christ's sake. Anytime. Oh, God. Oh, my buffs are gone. Fine, I'll hit you with EO. Ah, that did it. Woo! That guy was actually tough. Oh, hey, it's another gem. That's two of three, I think. There's three that we need, right? Something like three. Oh, yeah. More alchemy. Awesome. Okay. No chests hidden around here. I tried saying about and around at the same time, and it came out as a bound. I think, hilariously, that that's actually still <laughs> appropriate. Are there any chests abound? Okay. Awesome. So, there's the red shrine, the gold shrine, and there's another one around here. I want to say it's black. Where's the other shrine? It's this way. So we may have three shrines left. So that's at least three more episodes to go. And that's, you know, providing that the game will actually end after uh, the Gold Shrine. Or well, the offline game, anyways. Oh, yeah, that's another question I keep getting. Do you have to play this online? Well, I'm playing offline right now. After the first, like, two to three hours, depends on how fast you're playing. Uh, you can get the opening done in two hours. Anyhow, after the opening of the game... There's an event where the siblings that you've created during character development get split up. One of them goes to the online world, where you create your online character, one of the five races. That is pay-to-play. You do need an internet connection, and you do need to pay a monthly fee to play that. That story, however, diverges from this story, the offline story. Uh, the offline story, you play as your brother or your sister, whatever you made. And uh, that's what I've been doing recently. Mostly because my gaming schedule has been all over the place. And I just haven't felt that paying 
the monthly fee to play maybe four to six hours a month is not worth it right now. I will be getting back to playing online. There will be more online videos of Dragon Quest X coming your way from me. But uh, yeah, do not presume that just because there is an online mode that it's going to be similar to the... just because there is an offline mode, do not presume that it's going to be similar to the online mode. The two experiences, while the gameplay and core mechanics are the same, they're both very much Dragon Quest, they're entirely different experiences, and so far as I can tell, entirely different worlds. I have not seen any of these offline locations in the online game, and vice versa. End rant. Thin. That should get everybody caught up. So hopefully I won't see any more silly questions. Okay, so I'll talk to this dude. Yes, we got stuff done. Alright. Cool. Okay. Word. Is that another key? I think he gave me another key. Was that a key? People are handing me things, I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> um, yes, there is a new key handed to me. Red. Awesome. We know where we're going next. Red Shrine. But, before we go to the Red Shrine, this last boss fight, if it has taught me anything, it's that I might be slightly undergeared slash ill-prepared. If not me, then I need some stronger party members, and... You know what? I might do that next time. Um, somebody wrote down uh, some of the stuff that I needed. Oh, and I can't remember their name, and now I'm going to feel really bad about it. I wrote it down somewhere. Mel. Mel D. Thank you again, Mel D. Yes. Oh, I saw that you wrote down what some of the other people need. Ugh. I have not forgotten. Ugh, but I don't feel like wrestling with the quest system tonight. So let's check out the alchemy and see what upgrades we can get. Alright, so this is more medicine stuff. Oh, that looks familiar. That's right. Like, Songbird Honey or something, I think it was? Melody Honey? Uh, something along those lines. This same item was used in the online game for the uh, class-changing quest. Okay. Alright, some cool stuff. Alright. Some stuff that we can make. Okay, weapons. New sword. Much better. I think it might require the ring that we have. But look at that boost. That's, what, eight more power? Kind of hard to say no to that. Let's do it. Oh, that was a gold ring. I don't think that's even what I was using. Wasn't I wearing an agility ring? Yay. Okay, can't do that. What is this? Wands. Wands which are probably used to get better casters in our party. Woo, slime stack wand. Isn't that cute? sure we do have most of these materials somewhere hidden away. We do not have that wand. 
Not even sure where you get that. Might have to buy that one. What are these? Daggers? They appear to be daggers. Oh, we already had access to that. I don't think anyone's actually asked yet, though. We'll see. I'll look into it. Okay, so shields... Ooh. What do we need to make that? Okay. Well, we only need one thing. What is that? Kiyamo... something, 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 something? What is this? A funny looking hat. Kind of like a priest hat of some kind. Oh, they're robes for casters. I'm not going the casting route though, so a bit silly for me to aim for that. We can definitely make this... I want to say that's a magic shield, but I know I'm wrong. Because that's a magic shield. Might just be called a white shield. I forget what the English translation is. I haven't really been playing too much DQ as of late. Um, yeah, let's check the bank, see if we have this Kyo Mono something. See if we can make ourselves a new shield. I do like the crafting system in this. I've actually really enjoyed alchemy ever since they added it to Dragon Quest. Because it's there for you if you want it. Not usually required at all. And it's not complicated. If you played Final Fantasy XIV, the newest online one, you know what a complicated crafting system looks like, and it is terrible. But they made crafting, you know, nice and simple in these. I like it. The online crafting is fantastic, too. Okay, what was I looking for? That one. That's, that is the right character. I recognize that. Okay, new shield coming up. Let's go, Rubus. Uh, I went in the inn. You know what? We should stay at the inn anyways. You know, while I'm in here looking lost, I was like, can I help you? No. Wait. Yes. We're tired. Do you have a room? <laughs> he always has a room ready for us. New shield, new shield, new shield, new shield. I'm really not keen on that hat. But it's an upgrade. But it will look silly. <sighs> Fashion first, am I right? Alright, awesome new shield. Cool. Made all these. I've made that. 
I don't want to make the stupid hat. Oh, wait, there's more there, isn't there? Come back. What is this? I'm already wearing those, aren't I? I can't be. These are slightly better. Better gloves. Better shoes. No, they aren't. Some of these upgrades are very questionable. I mean, these... These are definitely an upgrade. What kind of gloves do I need? Hopefully those are basic. It's still, it's not even much of an upgrade. That's just by one. That is one point. Well... I mean, overall, they're better. I'll see what the shops have. And I'll see what else I can make in here before I go check the shops. Distracted! Oh, jewelry. Okay. So there's this stuff. Which requires me to already have these freaking rings. I, I know they're purchasable, but still. Oh, hey! Do we have any more alchemy books hiding? <laughs> I'll be damned. No, no, I can't make that. Okay, so that didn't add anything here. New shields? Or new weaponry? No. No, it doesn't look like... New armor? Yes. A bit. But not very. Ah, uh, it's more mage stuff, I think. It's that skirt. Yeah, it's caster gear. Boo, caster gear. Accessories again. Nothing too amazing that we can make. This is kind of cool. Only have two more keys to make. So we'll do the red shrine next, and then I'm assuming the red shrine we're going to get this one missing ingredient here to make the black key. Yeah, there it is. And then... after getting the black key... there's probably another boss in the black shrine, which will give us the last gem that we need to make the gold. Which is really what's leading me to believe that it's just these shrines in the offline game. Making it clock in at longer than the first Dragon Quest. <laughs> I would say that the offline is good on its own merit. Um, it is not going to be a full Dragon Quest experience. There's not really too much exploring to do. It's uh, this one island and the shrines. It's good. I'm enjoying it. Uh, I've definitely been looking forward to recording it when I can. But, uh... It fails in comparison to the scope of the online game. So until, like, the price comes down drastically or something, I wouldn't recommend spending any more than... You know Just don't... I actually... Uh, yeah, until the price comes down, don't pick up the game unless you're going to be playing online. Because that's where 90% of the game is going to be. Alright, dude. What do you have? You have nothing that I want. Useless. 
How about you? Do you have stuff I want? No! You do not. Wait, what do I have equipped? These gloves? Are there not better gloves elsewhere? These are better gloves. Darn right I want them. Yes, equip them. I still need a better chest piece, though. Alright, that is a huge sword. Bigger than she is. I know that's kind of a standard for Japanese role-playing games, but still. Still, I say. Alright, what are we at? We're at 36 minutes. I got all the upgrades that I can really get right now. I mean, I guess we can go hit the Red Shrine. If there's no boss in there, we should be fine, right? Right? Yeah, I'm gonna bank this stuff. <laughs> I'm going to hit the bank, and then I'm going to hit the church, and I'm going to save before tackling the Red Shrine. Oh, wait. No, no, no. I'm pulling stuff out. Damn! My goal in completing the Red Shrine is that I will get another alchemy book. Oh, please let me get another alchemy book. So, we're going to head out there, we're going to see what we can get done. We may or may not finish the Red Shrine today, if not, oh well, whatever. We'll still have an idea of what we're doing next time. And I like knowing what I'm doing. I like knowing the kind of trouble that I'm getting myself into. Whoops. No, no, I want to keep playing. Damn you. Hang on. I'll bring it back. Okay. I got it back. That's a good thing that I turned off the recording, too. I I just about hit every wrong button that I could in between here and there. I accidentally tried going online, and I don't have the VPN turned on right now, so my Wii is like, what are you doing? And then when I said, oh, you're right, I'm sorry, I can't go online. It's like, okay, I'll exit the entire game. So it exited me back to the Wii uh, home channel. <laughs> God. So I had to start the game up again. Uh, this is me sober. <laughs> Red Shrine, we remember there where that is. Past the Atlas, who we will not be fighting. We'll take him on before we do the Gold Shrine. How about that? Sound good? Actually, wondering how many more monsters I have to complete my uh, monster compendium. Can't be that many. You stay over there. Do not chase me. I'm watching you. You with your tree that you're using as a weapon. You terrifying beast. Ah. I 
I love this music. Who's the composer? Is it, uh... It's Koichi Sugiyama, right? He is a genius. Absolutely fantastic. Alright. Let's try this. Man, the colors are just horrible on this recording. I wish I had better hardware. You just, you, you'll have to take my word for it that the game looks better than this recording is making it out to be, and I apologize that it doesn't actually look as good as it should. This place looks like doom. I love it. Let's rock and roll. I needed a rock bomb for that to be funny. <gasps> There's one. Okay, alright, alright, let's do it again. <gasps> let's rock and roll! Or you can punch him in the face. That's cool, too. I don't know what he was doing up here anyways. Okay, not bad. Not bad. 91 experience points, 24 gold. Not really hurting for gold at this moment, though. We've purchased pretty much everything that we need to. Let's go get these Cure Slimes. Come here, Cure Slime! Probably gonna call for help. Previous games, they usually called knights of some kind. Usually. Not all the time. I think I might replace my thief. It's not doing too much. Or is he a minstrel? I can't tell. I think he's a minstrel. Yeah, he's a minstrel. Oi! Hey! No! Ah! Well, hey, slime drops are easy to come by over here. That's good. Oh, what's this? <gasps> it's a blue feather. I don't know if I've picked one of those up yet. I'll make good use of it. No, no, no. I'm attacking you! I'm sure, it doesn't really matter at all, but whatever. Guys, not too tough. Swing around here a couple more times, see if there's any more loot. That rock bomb is like right in our way. We can take him. Come here. Come on, guys, focus fire. Oh, God! Ah. Uh... Oh, that was surprising. No, 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 back off. Back off, silly mage. Minstrel? Cleric? I don't know what you are, but stay away from him. No, 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 you get away from her! Back off my healers!
please don't explode. <laughs> God. Don't stand next to him. Oh, he's, he's fine. Everyone's fine. What did he do? Did he not explode? Is he a dud? I thought we were dead. I guess we're fine. Cool. Okay, so loot in here. Some shiny stuff on the floor across the way. I think we can get there without attracting any attention. What say you? Oh, something noticed us. Finish looting before it gets there. Not sure what it was. Rock bomb? It must have been a rock bomb. They sprint when they see you. Looks like you just rolled right past. Okay, so cure slimes are also sprinters. We should be able to slide past this rock bomb. Yeah, we're good. Same goes for the cure slime. <gasps> oh, God. You guys are gonna suck, I can tell. Uh, EO! I'm going to hit you with magic. Is he paralyzed or confused? Somebody's weapon really confused him or something. Not sure what it was. Okay, we are gonna go ahead and head on out now and get saved. Definitely liking the Red Shrine though. Always nice to see new, new area types. Into a volcanic interior. I wonder if there's lava that you can walk through and get damaged. Like in the old school. In the olden days. Ah, uh, did you see that? Totally faked him out. Oh god, he's still chasing me. <laughs> alright, alright. Slimes everywhere. It's okay, I got this. Alright, aw, oh, damn. <laughs> Just one cure slime. We can handle it. Certainly feeling like I need more offense in my team, though. Could stand to lose the level 10 guys. They are going to get replaced soon. Word. Ugh, I'm going to have to fight you, aren't I? Oh, oh, I have to fight this one instead. That'll show you. You guys are getting hit by EO. Congratulations, you won a prize. Don't push him away from me. Stop chasing her. Guys, come over here. Stop dragging him. Oh my god. Do not run away. Bring the slime back to the tank. I can't help you if you're across the room. Yeah, that was awesome. Alright, let's try and sneak them. Oh no, they keep attacking me. Let's try and sneak them back up here. Not meaning to run away, I just want to fight him on my terms and not down there. Never mind. You're all dead to me. Bam, escaped. That was terrible, idiots. Like, hey guys, not, let's not fight him back in the center of the room where we'll get jumped by more fellows as soon as we're done fighting. Let's not do that. Okay, we're just going to fight him down here where all the rock bombs are. Hi. What do we got, 50 minutes? Yeah. 
I think I called that correctly. Let's get back to town. Dura! Alright, do we have items to deposit? Maybe kind of slime drop, some kind of blue feather, rock. Still not sure what these are. What are these? It looks like some kind of meal. Is that mochi? No, not mochi. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Step the inn real quick. Go save our game. And that'll be it for today. I want to say this is episode 16. I can't be sure. I'll, I'll figure it out when I upload it. Alright everybody, thanks for watching. I'm your host, Saigon. This is the Dragon Quest X Let's Play. Uh, I will be posting some more Halo 4 videos. So, um you can just deal with it. <laughs> but, uh, of course, more Dragon Quest X coming, uh, more Dragon Warrior Classic coming, and I do have another import game that I will probably do a Let's Play of in the future, and uh, I'll show off what that is um, the next time I do a video uh, with a collection update. So, again, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time.